All right guys, a little fishing on a kayak today. We're out at the lake. Uh, there's quite a few of us out here today. We're gonna have a little friendly bragging rights competition. Those set requirements could be biggest bass by weight, length, most fish caught. We're just having some fun today. Joined up with the Ohio Valley Bass Yackers today also. Doing a little practicing before Jason's tournaments get started next weekend. Got one finally. Well, it's not massive, but it'll get me on the board. Got him. All right. Man, another dink. You know I can't get you. All right, let's let him go. Get him logged on Facebook. So, so far, one bass was tucked, everything was up on the bank and shallow. One was tucked underneath a tree. That one was right up on the bank. That's a nice bass. Well, it feels nice. The other ones did too. <laughs> yeah, he's a little bigger guy. Come on. Got him. Oh, it's a big crappie. Jesus, he's huge. <laughs> I'll take him. All right, nice 11 and a half inch crappie. That's a nice fish. Well, <laughs> he's about the same size as what I've been catching out here. They just feel good though. They're really fighting. Ouch, ouch, it's in my finger. Little fat guys out here though. Got one. <laughs> I don't even think I'm not even gonna measure him. He's just too little.
All right, guys, I got my medium action spinning rod set up here with my Mojo Bass medium action rod. And I use a Ned Rig head tied to six pound fluorocarbon line. Right there's a setup. And the Kai Tech Easy Shiner and Sight Flash was what was the ticket today because the, the water was a little bit murky. Uh, the wind was really picking up. I should have put an underspin on this if I, if I had known I'd have put an underspin on, but I didn't know the water was going to still be that murky. Uh, it usually clears up pretty good out there after a few days of rain. But um, anyways, there's the Kitech Easy Shiner right there in Sight Flash. Nice bait, little expensive. Uh, they don't last long on the hook. Uh, you catch about two or three bass and you're replacing it with another one. But if you're in tournament fishing and you got to put bass in a boat, it's a great bait to use on tough days like today where uh, the temperature dropped um, almost 20 degrees in the, la in the last two days than it was just a few days ago. The wind was picked up today pretty good. Um, that put the bass a little bit different, uh, but they were they were in pre-spawn mode. Some may be spawning right now. The water temperature was 58 degrees. Uh, just a few days ago, it was 68 degrees. So it, it threw them off a little bit. But anyways, we made it happen. We caught a few small ones and a nice crappie. Nice to get out there and practice with the High Valley Bass Yackers. Make sure you check them out on Facebook. Jason starts his tournaments next weekend in the kayak tournaments. Um, I will miss the first tournament, but that's okay. We'll, we'll do some catching up on the next few tournaments he's got coming up uh, to get some points on the board. So, all right, guys, hope you enjoyed the video. Uh, make sure you like, subscribe, and share, and we will catch you on the next lake.